Hey guys, Yvonne here at YvonneManna.com and in this video I want to talk to you about the long overdue tracking call unsuccessful error that you might be seeing in your Microsoft Ads account when creating an ad. So if you put in your final URL and you add in your tracking template, you will see, you, you might see an issue that looks like this, tracking call unsuccessful. So if you click on test, it's gonna say that and you might be worried and saying, oh, that means I'm not tracking. So first of all, if you followed everything I show you in my video, in my other video on setting up uh, Click Magic with Microsoft Ads, I'll put the link above. If you set it up correctly, this error does not matter at all, okay? So I will tell you how to get rid of this error. There is a way to get rid of it and it still works fine, but I just wanna let you know, this does not affect anything. I have done numerous tests because I, I, I wanted to come to a conclusion and the fact that it says tracking call unsuccessful, as long as everything else here is okay, so click the three dots, as long as the landing page is found and you know this might or might not say landing page found, that's okay. As long as this says landing page found, you're fine. So my latest experiment was just a few days ago and these clicks right here in the middle, uh, these clicks are for something else and I'll tell you that in a second. These clicks right here are clicks that I paid for that showed up just fine, right? As you can see here, they're showing up my keyword, they're showing up my ad ID, all these other tokens that I added, they're all showing up just fine, you know, exactly as I add them in here. So the fact that it says tracking call unsuccessful, don't worry about it. Go ahead and try this yourself, follow my video step by step exactly as I show it. And if you do it correctly, the tracking call unsuccessful will not uh, impact you at all. The only reason it might impact you is if you set something up incorrectly. So if you did set up tracking not the way I showed, then yes, but then that's a different issue. It has nothing to do with the tracking call unsuccessful, okay? So that's what I wanted to talk to you first about is that don't worry, don't freak out, your ads are still tracking. Now you might be asking, Yvonne, you said you're gonna tell us how to get rid of this error. Yes, there is a way to get rid of it. So if you head over to shared library here and you click on view URL options, you simply click on this button here that says add Microsoft Click ID. Now, if you recall in the previous videos, we talked about removing this. Microsoft has been doing a bunch of changes, okay? And so now clicking this is totally acceptable. It still works, it still tracks, okay? So keep in mind, as of right now, as of watching this video, what I'm showing you works, Microsoft might change it again in a few months or a year or years or, or, or days, whatever, okay? But as of right now, clicking this will actually be okay, okay, click save. And now if we head back over into campaigns, and again, if you set everything up correctly, exactly as we showed you, click on Diabetes Freedom, let's click on our ad again. Uh, let's select this ad. And if we go to this URL option, let's click on that, let's click test. And now it says landing page found. If we click here, everything is fine. Tracking call is successful. But again, this doesn't matter. As long as your landing page is found, you are good to go. You're in perfect shape, okay? Uh, the way I did that is, uh, the way I can confirm it's working is, again, by paying for clicks. I set that up, I toggled on the add MS, uh, MS click ID, Microsoft click ID. And as you can see, everything is still tracking for me correctly, okay? So again, if something is not tracking correctly, has nothing to do with the tracking call unsuccessful, has nothing to do with the MS Click ID, check your setup, check your URLs, make sure your URL is correct. Sometimes if you have like another word, like word cookies here, for example, you might forget to add them in, okay? So make sure the URL that you added matches the exact URL of your tracking link, okay? And that's pretty much it, that's all there is to it. Make sure to check out my Click Magic playlist for additional kind of tips and tricks like this. My Microsoft ads, my Google ads playlists, all that stuff. Uh, and check out my courses at ivanmana.com slash all dash courses to learn more about paid ad networks. But that's all I wanted to show you in this video. Thank you for watching, I hope it was helpful. I will see you in the next one.